Good morning, guys. It is one of those early Saturday mornings yet again. And this time, we aren't going to the beach for karate. We're going to do, uh, we're going to the beach to do some fishing. I'm not the best of fishermen, but I know how to fish. But today I'm going as the drone pilot. But it's kind of looking a bit windy to fly the drone. But let's see what happens. So it is just about five o'clock, and we are expecting sunrise sometime soon. Um, it is still before sunrise. But as you can hear, the birds are already out and doing what they do best so we are getting on our way Are here at the beach. Um, I think the problem is we came too early. It seems like the fish are still sleeping. <laughs> um, but it doesn't seem anything's happening. It's now like uh, half past six. And just after we saw the sunrise, um, it was extremely covered by clouds. Behind me, Thank you. yeah. See? There's like about 80% to 90% cloud cover going on at the moment. So it is what it is. But anyway, let's see what happens. When we got here, we looked up. Um, UAV forecast so that's like a app tells you weather conditions for flying and it permitted us not to fly because it is quite windy the wind has died down but I mean um, we don't want to take out the drone since that there's nothing going on I don't know how many of you do this anymore well, I don't get a chance to do it anymore, but now I'm doing it. Just sit, lay back on the floor, look up and stare at, this, at the clouds. It's absolutely relaxing. So it's now 7 o'clock and welcome to Drone Fishing 101 with Rishan D me okay so anytime you see me carrying this case in the vlogs you should know it's the drone All right <coughs> let me set up the tripod and then we can get going okay hopefully you can hear me okay hopefully you can hear me We are flying the DJI Mavic 2 Zoom. Right, Mavic 2 Zoom. Okay, open up. So, 
So if you'd like to see a review of this drone, check out Tech Scene ZA. And that video can be linked, uh, will be linked up above you, right in the YouTube cards. Alright, open up. That's done. We take off the gimbal protector. Alright, that in there. So I've been rolling in the sand a little bit, so I'm trying to keep the sand out of the, the case. Uh, um, we have a fully charged battery in there. And now, this is the Gannett Blade Dropper. By Gannett, of course. So, I'm just going to put this on here. So, how the bait dropper works is there's a light underneath the drone, and what it does when you turn the light on, it locks a pin underneath the drone, and then you thread your line through that. And then when you reach drop, you switch your light, the light off and it drops the bait wherever you want, you want to drop it. So first thing I'm going to do is actually hook the line up to the gannet and then we're going to take off because that's easier than me hovering and trying to lock the line to the bait drop. Leave it.
six and a half hours later. So I guess um, my awesome piloting skills came in handy and they caught something. Uh, once again guys, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.